The show was called 111 and it was a look at the iconic moments of clothing over the last hundred years. Now, you didn't need to know that to appreciate a collection of very striking, beautiful clothes. I love it because the clothes are different. There's something like a very specific style about it, but they're so beautiful and they make a woman look really pretty. so creative. Just a really creative person, very beautiful at the same time, creative, beautiful, elegant. What else can you get, you know? There was a really beautiful, pretty dresses that are very easy to wear for every girl. They're very feminine, especially the dresses in the beginning. I thought it was a, a great show for him. Well, transformation and flux have been themes of yours for a long, long time. How did it occur to you to turn a dress from Victorian England or Victorian times into a dress from the 20s? How, how, would, it, how would it occur to you that that was even possible? Basically, I laid out all the garments, I, I drew out all the things from all the garments I thought were representative of different eras and decades. And I thought, well, how can I cross these over? So there's actually quite a lot of cross-pollination of what elements you can borrow from one era and use them in the next one. So there was actually trial and error, going back and forth, re-sketching, etc. It was very much an experiment that I think, uh, that I was lucky enough that it worked at the end. I was really not aware that you could actually use that sort of technology within clothing. It was really magical and an incredibly brave thing to do and went off perfectly and seamlessly. And the clothes are beautiful. It wasn't like just a, a, a show of showmanship. I thought they were incredibly beautiful pieces in there. I think that was no mean feat to achieve all of that with clothes. And it was an extraordinary combination of commercial and fantastical and uh, an encapsulation of the evolution of fashion in, uh, in four outfits and less. Hussein has been rather stuck with the label that he's a fashion boffin, that he's a sort of ideas guy. But I think tonight he proved once and for all that he is a wonderful fashion designer. The fact that the finale happened to include some of the best special effects I've ever seen on a fashion catwalk was just a wonderful bonus.